2.5 is right around the corner. One of the exciting things is going to be the Reliant being flight ready. Now, Dave Hobbins actually hooked us up with some really awesome concept art, and then the team around the world has been making this ship come to life. Now, the interesting thing about this ship is it's a Sion technology influence, right? And we've only seen one other ship before that's in Sion, and everyone knows it's a scout. So, you know, these ships are multi-state, they're transforming, they're unique, they're different, they fly different. So the Reliant is a ship that I was really excited to get my hands on because I think Hobbins did a great job with the design um, and I think the flight mode is pretty interesting as well. Uh, so my team here in LA, we did a lot of the heavy lifting on the modeling and a lot of the preliminary anim animations and of course we had teams all around the world touching it in Austin doing animations and in the UK doing textures for the materials uh, so we brought it all together here. Uh, one really cool detail about the Reliant which some people might not notice is, I mean obviously it has a vertical flight mode but because of the vertical flight mode uh, the engines have reverse thrusts on the front side of them that act as retro thrust to slow the ship down. Uh, when it's in horizontal mode, the front of those engines are covered up. So in order to achieve retro thrust, we have a shunting system that takes the thrusts and redirects it to the front of the wings where we open up flaps that function as retro thrust as well. So look out for those, those are pretty cool. You know, leading up to this uh point I'd been working on a uh, refactor for, for uh, tuning for all the ships and so I was able to work in uh, the ability to support uh, multiple flight states for our ships and uh, we've used that for the Reliant and now that we have that we should uh, that, that'll open us up to do a lot of uh, other ships with multiple flight states as well. When you're coming in for a landing doing really close precision flight you'll be flying that in the horizontal mode of the ship and then when you've taken off cleanly from a landing pad then uh, you'll you know, hit your landing toggle, go into the vertical mode, and you'll have the full performance of the ship available to you. So what this actually is going to mean is we have our, you know, our precision, our SCM, and our cruise modes. So when you're in the horizontal mode, you're going to be locked into precision. You don't get to go the top speed of the ship, and it's very constrained in what you're going to be able to do movement-wise. And we've also made sure that you aren't going to accidentally, you know, like pitch forward too quick and flip onto the roof of your ship and blow up because that's just not fun. Uh, so you'll, you'll take off and then you'll hit N, which is our new default key for toggling the landing mode. Uh, and then from there you'll go into your full flight mode where you'll have the full performance of the ship and your full SCM cruise speed, uh, be able to go into quantum travel. Now there is one thing that we did have to restrict a little bit while you're in the flight mode and that's actually getting in or out of the pilot or co-pilot seats. Uh, so just because of the space of the Reliant cockpit, it's really tight in there uh, when it's transformed. And so you will have to go into your landing mode before either the pilot or the co-pilot can get out of the seats. It may be something that we can expand on in the future, but for right now it's just how we were able to get the ship flying while also having these transformational elements. Uh, also into the future, we're definitely hoping to get it set up where the horizontal mode can be a full uh, a full speed capable mode of travel, but we wanted to make sure we were at least delivering, hey, you've got this toggling transition state for the flight ready, uh, even if you know one of the modes you don't get to have that full speed potential. So really looking forward to you guys getting your hands on this ship in the coming patch. We're really proud of the Reliant and the hard work that everyone at CIG has put into it. We cannot wait to see what you guys think of it, as well as we can't wait to see you guys out there flying it around. So, hope you guys like it as much as we loved making it.